Greetings everybody. I know what you're saying. Damn, it's been a long time since he made a video. So, without further ado, this is my video to you. As you can see, I am doing it hands free. <laughs> oh, what was that that you see? Hmm. This is Comrades Kill Devil Eastern North Carolina Barbecue Dip. Not a sauce. It, well, it is considered a, a spicy vinegar dipping sauce for pulled pork. Now, I've tried this. It's excellent. But, of course, you guys want honest, honest reaction to some things. And to this, you want to see this honest reaction. So, without further ado, I am going to dip my finger into this. As you can see. Here's some sauce. Ooh, yeah. Oh, ho, 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 yeah, buddy. Now, <coughs> it's got a, it's vinegary, so it's vinegar-based barbecue dipping sauce. Um, now, it says just to use for pulled pork, but I, I'm, I'm also thinking that you could probably use it for a, uh, beef uh, you, you need something that has more uh, tendons and stuff and pork and beef would be good with this I wouldn't do it with the chicken because it is a vinegar based and a vinegar based marinade and or dip doesn't do well with chicken uh, chicken, you would need more of a citrus marinade. But that, that's my other thing. I would not just use this for a dip. I would also use this for a marinade. Can you imagine having some killer sauce like this? At your next picnic. Okay? You're having barbecue. You're having a pork chop. You put this in it and let it sit for a half half an hour. Then you put it up on the grill. It's going to blow everybody's minds. Okay? I will be putting a link to their uh, website. And they also are on Facebook. And they will also be at the Farmer's Market next weekend. I hope but we will keep you in we you know if you go to uh, connect Illyria you'll find out who's going to be at the vendors at the, the vendors at the uh, at the flea market at the but they deep 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 farmers market and you know, have a fun time there because man we got we got people to Oh man, I'm just gonna say, we got, oh man, we got this guy, uh, oh, oh man, I forgot his last name, oh my god, Luther, guy by the name of Luther, he's a blues artist, he lives in the area, uh, those of you who went out to Kelly, have been out to Kelly's Island, who are probably know who I'm talking about, this guy is good. I got a CD. Um, matter of fact, <laughs> I know my videos are a little bourgeois, little you know thing. But you know, this is how it goes. Uh, let me grab the CD here. It's uh Luther Tramel. Uh, I'm hope I'm doing your uh, 
Hope I'm doing that right, Luther. <laughs> Hope I'm doing that right. And uh, John Sutton, he, he's the Monica player on this. These guys are good. Um, he said something about Kelly's Island next weekend, so those of you that are out in that area, you want to hear some good music? Um, I don't know if he has anything with Facebook or anything like that. I will check. If he does, I will put the link down below. Okay? Good. Now, this is, I'm, I'm calling this the, uh, I don't know, maybe the Super Farmer Market video because that's all I'm going to be talking about. And now, we get to the other good stuff. You guys always love when I do the taste test thing, so I get just two for one. That's right, I got some more stuff for you guys that I have tested out. And as you can tell, I have tested it out very extensively. <laughs> this is from Sugar Bear. And this one is the uh, strawberry cheesecake. And as you can tell, I like it. Dude, it has the creaminess of the cheesecake in the somewhat tartness of the strawberry and it's just ah it's just music in your mouth and I do mean that it is just beautiful music in your mouth I give this five popcorn balls five now This next one is actually one I tried before, but he said that it was a new and improved pina colada. So I had to have some. Oh, yeah. This, I, last time I had this, I raised it up to a ring. Now it's just bursting with the flavor of pina colada. And, um, I'm giving this also a five. Very good. wait there's one more that's right this one is called bacon cheeseburger <laughs> yes bacon cheeseburger Ah. Now, the flavor of the cheese hits you right off the bat, which is good. Then in the background, the background of the cheese part, you taste the bacon. And it's also got the beef flavor in there. It actually tastes like you bit into a bacon cheeseburger. Now, I don't know if, the, if it's just me, but I may 
taste a hint of mustard. Hmm. Let me check the back of the bag here, because you know they have to list the ingredients. Yeah. Uh, pop room, pop room. I don't know because I. I don't see it. Maybe maybe it's just me. But well, there is a lot of a lot of uh, technical stuff that. The federal government has you put all this stuff if it's... Aha! Yes! There is mustard powder. I knew it! I knew it! <laughs> I love it when I'm right on something. <laughs> I need that five popcorn balls plus because it just it's got layers and layers and layers of flavor and it all comes together the right amount uh, pop like party in your mouth kind of well, so that is my wrap up of, uh, of the farmer's market. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And um, hope to see you guys at the farmer's market. Okay? That's the Lurch thing. Peace. I'm out of here. Until next time. Make sure you always say I love you to the people that care. Because one day you may not be able to do that.